present uh, government now because uh, when the President Tinubu Azum uh, his office as the President for the Republic of Nigeria, I was overwhelmed and glad. I'm happy because the man I knew very well that uh, when he got there, he knew what he's doing. Number two, I want all Nigerian. We have to rise up and encourage Tunubu because at the time he came into power, if he didn't come to power at the time he came in to power, I give you just three, six months, the Nigeria will collapse because of our economy, because uh, other people, they don't even care about the economy. And I want to tell you one thing today, Tunubu is not looking for money. He's not looking for name. If we li listen to his speech, he said, we must not fear Nigeria. You heard it from him? Yeah. Good. That was his concern. The other people that came in, a lot of them, they don't even know. Some of them did not know left from right. I don't want to mean, mention name. You look at what he did for all years of today. The day he came to the office, said, the strategy is gone. Where I saw it, I was so overwhelmed. Because I knew very well that um, the people who are, who are enjoying this stuff today were about six or seven in the country, and I know them. Some of them, they are my customer. You know, I've been in the business for about five, for five years now as a marketer. Let me just give you that, uh, you know, introduce myself from the humble, humble beginning. I have the biggest depot in Nigeria, to the, the largest, to the largest in the world, petroleum depot in Lagos. Not in my town, not in, uh, you know, Bayesa. Go to Lagos, a papa, you see there. I knew what happened in the country. Other people, they were meeting about the, how to solve the problem of petroleum. I can solve it for federal government. You don't need problem, you don't need anybody. Because some of the people that are so, that, that, that have a lot of money about this, uh, they are my customer. I give them five to truck. 10 truck, take 10 truck, take care uh, in some way. I want to buy 25. No, 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 you can't get 25. Takes 10. Some of them are my customers. If you see what they are doing in Nigeria now, I've ever heard that uh, somebody built this uh, service station for two or three billion. They are in Nigeria. Three billion, not billion, no. In this country. That's why I said, if Tinubu did not come, come into power, the country would have collapsed one day. With our population, 216, that's our population. Where are we going? Are we going to meet Ghana? <laughs> or Togo? Or Cameroon? Or Gambia? Tell me. Nobody can take any of us. Let's stay in this country, stay in this country, and I pray and say the truth. We know what the problem we had in Nigeria. Nobody to say the truth. People are dodgy. I don't want to say the truth. I don't want them to kill me. I don't want to kill who? And they die now. If you say the truth, they kill you. You know, your, your children will know what you die for. You are the side of the truth. That's why they kill uh -huh. You say, That's what you want. That was the, that's the problem we have in this country. The man did what thing that impresses me. Within 
two months, you save about one point, I think 1.7 for, for three, trillion for Nigeria. What does people have been there for 20 years? Uh, no, times that uh, 1.7 times two, 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 20 years. Where, where did they keep the money? Look from that place. We all should rise up, to rise and support uh, Tinubu. I want you to discern it. You have a lot of role to play because you do a lot of things more than me when it comes to social media. Let's help him. If you look at his face, he's facing a lot of challenges. And I will tell you one thing today. Note it down. The people who are fighting Tinubu now, they are not Nigerians, so the Kaba. Prince, are you listening to me? The Kaba, they are the ones that sponsored a lot of people under. Fight him. Fight him. You have to drop this, uh, you know, uh, subsidy. Let's drop it for them to enjoy it. They are the ones. When I look at some people, you say, I'm a Kenikon. I don't want to make measure of some name. A lot of names who are just shouting for nothing and they have been giving kickback. That was what happened. They collected who Jamal from the Kaba. They are the ones that fight it to Numbu, not Nigerians. Are you getting my point? It's not Nigerians. God has saved them. I'm a monarch now. There's a little or not, I can do that. I am a just prince. A prince in Nigeria, but ah, you could have, some people would have run away from this country. Of course, I know them. I know them. Because I'm a, I'm a monarch. But they, we had to manage things. Because I knew I have a lot of enemy because of my state of Nigeria. I have to be very careful. But solving this problem now, people who are just started, it's not everybody. Because the educated one, they knew what happened in Nigeria that it was some Kaba who has sponsored about almost 10 groups go and fight to shout about uh, all your stuff, to search about food, tell about uh, Keniko, Ede, and Gary, Keniko, that is costly. Gary has been costly for years in this country. Is that to know who? The man came to, to, to rescue us from the problems. Are you getting my point? To help, I mean, not because, because I'm a Yoruba. No, 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 no. Yoruba will say, one day they said, Uju, Monto, Yonu. The man is helping us. They don't want to, not that he's going to marry another small young lady. Or he's going to find money to build house. There has been no all over the world. But it's concerned now how to build Nigeria from the political. That is his problem. We have to support him. I told you something about uh, oil. It's a simple thing, simple, simple mathematics, a marketer of 45 years, simple mathematics. All this uh, scrap, scrap. In front of some of them are scrap, scrap, you know. <laughs> Don't you hear the first uh, Femi Falano? He said, number one, the front line, they didn't share money, so so tight, the number one, number two, number three, and this, and this. Where are the amount? That's what he said on the day of uh, labor, protests, or what? They must be. They let the government bring the money. That question is very meaningful to Nigeria. Number two, I've not seen the president in a very me I him to talk. The problem of uh, the final we can solve it in this country. Identify about 10 states, 10 states in Nigeria. Since then, we tell you know, modular refinery. It's not the traditional refinery, modular. 
I want you to say this out. So that's I'm telling you, it's a modular, maybe 15 states in Nigeria, it will be 10, 20,000 barrel per day. And it's not uh, between three months. They have been constructed, we start operation. Just identify the people they give it to somebody that have tank. A marketer, not a portfolio marketer. You know, we have a lot of who are the people who are enjoying this country now that are portfolio marketers. The real marketer, <laughs> I'm sorry, Joe. The real marketer, they don't, they don't, they face them off. No portfolio marketer that dance around the budget every second. And identify the real marketer with tank, petroleum tank. Experience. This is for you. Government will give them good oil. They can supply the, the, the good oil. They will say, okay, maybe they are selling it uh, ninety-five uh, dollar pie. What do they call it? They will say, okay, go and pay sixty-five. I, I'm not talking for myself. We have a lot of people that have uh, petroleum tank in Lagos. In Lagos, now we have about 90 tank. But I tell, there's always some people build it. They don't know what to do about it. Ah, people are making it in a petroleum you know, business. Let me build my own. Why they build it? They don't know what to do. They just take money from the bank. They still remain there. The traditional market, market, sorry. Give them chance, support them. The government, what we need to do is to help them. They started well, honestly. I want to be frank to you. Started well. They are not, uh, you don't see the ministers. They dropped some of them yesterday. They put another one again. Maybe before the, they finish the other side, they are going to drop another. <laughs> That's democracy. I got a point. Democracy, that's democracy, and kudos for him. That's democracy. And this, uh, this guy again, Alake, he's trying his best. He talk with authority. People like Alake, I'm celebrating that guy. I like him. He's like me, he's very bold. So people will come to come by him. If you have to come and help you, you don't know yourself, you don't know what you are doing. I will not advise somebody that do <laughs> that have experience more than your father. Yeah, that's it. They are doing what I want Nigeria to do. Let's support him. There's no need with anybody to criticize him. It's too early. Two months. Two months. Give me like two years. Three years. Support him. We are not supporting him with money. Support him with wealth of courage. Hear him. You probably say, Yini Yini, can you cut to see it me? So, me is performing. I like it. <laughs>